Welcome along then to Sochi and the Russian Grand Prix, one of eight cities in the world to play host to both the Olympics and a Formula One race. It's a Grand Prix that's proven difficult to crack for anyone beyond the first two rows of the grid in recent years, so let's see if that can change today. Situated just three miles from the Georgian border, the 3.6 mile Sochi Autodrome has two notable overtaking opportunities into turn one and then turn 13. 18 corners in total here, 12 to the right and 6 to the left, and it's an average lap speed of around 130 miles per hour. And I'm joined once again by Anthony Davidson to bring you the lowdown for today's race. Let's talk about the Iceman. Looks like they've got a tough race in store today as grid penalties from changing power unit components has forced them further down the field. But on the bright side, at least those fresh components can help them maintain the power they need to come through the pack. I expect to see them take a more aggressive approach today to make up for the compromised start. It's time to take a look at our starting grid for today's race. Good job yesterday from Valtteri Bottas. The Finn starts from pole position, and it's Lewis Hamilton alongside. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Norris, Ricardo, Sebastian Vettel, and Verstappen, Perez, Leclerc, Albon, and Esteban Ocon. Iceman, they've taken a grid penalty. Stroll, Daniel Kvyat, and Gasly, Magnussen, Grosjean, Kimi Raikkonen, and Antonio Giovinazzi, Russell, and Nicholas Latifi. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of F1 2020 Career Mode. Today, we're at the Sochi Grand Prix in good old Russia. Good old Mother Russia. Uh, well, not my Mother Russia, but uh, yeah. We actually qualified first. Uh, why we're placed 10th is we did an ICE swap, and all of our, 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 our other ICEs were meh. They were two were pretty damaged, all well, one was pretty damaged. Two were meh, and I was like, no, I do remember the circuit. We did pretty good with on the circuit in F2. So during practice, I kind of see what I could do on uh, the old IC, and I was like, no, there's a push. So I was like, you know what? I'll decide to switch. Good thing it was a good switch. So uh, we decided to do that switch over. So we placed first in qualifying. We we're starting 11th. Uh, so we have a bit of a, a few cars to pass. Hopefully we can do the most of that during the start here, so let's get it going. Let's get this thing revved up here. Our overtake button in place. Get out of here, Albon. Run wide there a little bit. I'll give Leclerc a bit of room there. All right, we're looking good so far. He's our overtake to catch up to the rest of the pack here. Running wide there a little bit. I gotta really be careful about that sausage there.
Nice move. Good job. DRS will be enabled this lap. You can use it when within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. I gotta love it, the car just dived right in, he's like, nope. Even though the door is closing, I'm gonna dive straight in. is leading the race. Oh, I think I guess I got a little bit too aggressive there. At least there's no wing damage or anything. And we were able to recover fast enough. then catch up to uh, fast as you guys ever again. Jeez. Thought I dealt with them in the first lap.
How close can we do with Claire here? We're gonna go and pit this lap. Tass is stopping now. Okay, there we go. Went a little bit hot, but we came in right around the right time. Bottas was pinning in, so we're gonna pit right now. Uh, okay, not too bad. A little bit of a mix up there on the first uh, few laps. Go. Exit now. We're racing we're going a little exit. bit too hard. Complete. Go now. But looks like we made the right choice, even though we. Oh, maybe not. I thought we'd be fast. We're stopping already, but. Strategy complete. Ricardo. See these tires through to the end now. There's a name, Ricardo. Now we just. Oh, it's not too bad. We caught up. We got to, leave to where we were. But we are on fresher tires. Fuel is looking really good. You're managing it well. Work that brings you up the place. Ragged brings out the fifth. Now I have to catch first stop and is up in first place.
lap to the car in front is 9.5 seconds. So I think we might just well just hunker down for the last these last seven laps, hold off Vettel. And we're stabbing. Because we're not gonna catch up to Hamilton Hamilton, it's just too far away. He's got nine eleven seconds. That's, I can't catch eleven seconds like that. That's crazy. That will be hopefully a podium for us. Looks like Vettel's having issues. We're snapping on the on the prowl now. Something's a quick boy. I'm quite happy with this result for third place. After starting, well, qualifying first and starting 11th. So hopefully we get driver of the day here. To the car in front is 12.8 seconds. A little bit of an early break there. Damn it, Valtteri Bottas. Take my fastest lap away from me. Ooh, leg, leg, leg. Woo, but either way, third place. Good it's job. awesome. Did really well. Super driving. Yes, third place. Finally, got some uh, some points on the board. Of course, Mercedes won again. I feel like Mercedes is going to win everything. But, not much we can do. Okay, let's see here. Let's see here. What's the score? What's the verdict? So, after a magnificent race, we can now see the drivers making their way to the podium. Once again, Third it's place. the Silver Arrows who take top spot. I will take that. Let's have a look then at the driver's standings. More points for Valtteri Bottas, further oh, so we were, his lead I had at the top a little of the bit faster than so, Lewis Davidson, Hamilton, so it would be really hard for us to catch up to him. Of the day. I have to give it to Iceman. They fought so hard and had incredible pace at times, so I don't think anyone else did a better job today. It's another clear win for Mercedes one, as they managed yeah. to secure the Constructors' title. Six. An incredible performance. Yeah, Sebas had a lot of issues. I wonder if that's when he got sandwiched. We were stopping myself, next. or when I when he tried to cut in when I was turning in, could have been that maybe. Uh, Latifi, of course, Alpha at the, at the bottom. Lando's got had issues quite quickly actually. Setting wise, okay, we're still third place, good. Uh, Max Verstappen is catching us slowly, so we have to perform better the next couple of races. Constructors, we are second. That's good. I think we should be good for Constructors. Um, to win that in the next five races, I think, roughly. Uh, we have to gain some more points. We have to beat Max Verstappen so we can keep gaining points. Um, I, I finish third.
But so far, so good. That was a much better race than we had during the last episode of the, in Singapore. Not sure if it was a time change when we got to the Singapore or what. Let's have your thoughts. Let's have a look. It's looking like the championship is already won. Do you think there's still time for this to change? Uh, there's always... This is definitely always time for change. It's not over until I have that trophy in my hands. <laughs> I do what I can, but I'm really not sure. It's true. Do you think that grid penalty was justified? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, you break the rules, you pay the price. It's true. It is what it is. Did you struggle to get through all that traffic today? Uh, not really. Uh, there was no struggle. I just pushed as hard as I could. Not really as I have much more grip than others. I had a grace of belly dancer. Uh... It's safe to say you're smashing everyone's expectations, isn't it? Absolutely. Maybe they should expect more. Uh, yeah, it's team effort for sure. Great. Well, that's everything. Good interview. Good enter. Good ending to this episode. Good ending to this weekend Grand Prix. Uh, we beat Seb. Awesome. Five two. Where are we at? Like roughly thirteen to ten. Okay. So far, the good four races remaining. That's not too bad. Uh, I'm not sure if we'll be able to do any upgrades for the rest of the season, but we'll see. Um, but no, that was a that was a much better uh, result here compared to Singapore. Uh, so hope you guys like this episode much better, oh much more than the other one. Uh, our next episode is going to be the Japanese Grand Prix. I don't remember the Japanese Grand Prix, my, Grand Prix myself, so we'll see uh, how we do. But uh, that that will be during our next episode. So hope you guys like this video hit the like button hit the dislike button hit subscribe down below come part of the group and then you'll be notified when i release these episodes but until then you guys take it easy